everybody, and welcome back to another Blue Jays Today Minute Monologue. In this one, guys, the Blue Jays beat the Tampa Bay Rays 3-1 to in quite the pitching battle. Kevin Gosman was absolutely phenomenal. Let's get into the details. Nick, what did you think about Kevin Gosman today? So here's the big thing, right? I think that a lot of the Blue Jays community was getting on roster. We're getting on Mark today. We're like, why are we not in on Frankie Montas, the Pablo Lopez? Listen, if Kevin Gosman can pitch like that for the remainder of the season, we good, guys. We don't need anybody else. Eight innings, ten strikeouts. I think he gave up one hit, no run. One hit, runs, one walk, man. that's it. Like, that is a dominant, dominant, dominant performance. If he can continue that, if Burrios can continue that, like, we're chilling with the mm. starting pitchers, I think. Absolutely. And then the rest of the pitching was just Jordan Romano. He gave up the solo dinger in the ninth, yeah. but he was protected by the Blue Jays, who got three runs. First inning, we scored one run with Boba Shett mm -hmm. off the RBI double from Vlad, then the single from Boba Shett. Absolutely phenomenal. And then Danny Jansen with a two yeah. out, I believe it was two out, two run single. Two out, yeah. single. Amazing. Four in the two runs just to give that insurance, which ultimately did matter in the end based off of that solo dinger that Romano gave up. Now, I do have one thing to note, I think, and question to you as well. And honestly, question to all of you guys. How are we feeling about the aggressive base running? Because we're starting to see the other shoe drop a little bit. Now, we have gotten a lot of runs from it, but we're also seeing some guys get thrown out at second, stealing, being a lot of aggressiveness. What do you think about well, that? Well, here's my thing. It's becoming a little bit too aggressive. Yes, Vladdy did steal third successfully, but if he gets thrown out, that was a dumb a dumb way to get... And also know. an unnecessary base. No, that's what I was going to say. That's what I was going to say. It's two outs. You don't want to be stealing third, but he did it. But because he got it, no one's going to say anything. And as well, Lord is Gurriel trying to stretch, stretch a single, what's usually single for him, into a double. Just a little bit unnecessary. And there was that one stolen base where Chapman got thrown out second when they did a pitch out. So obviously they're starting to pick up on it. Maybe it's a sign thing they're yeah, going to switch up. Yeah. But they got to make an adjustment now that they're making this aggressive play think, as John Schneider is manager. A, a bit of a happy medium here moving forward. I like it, but just not, you know, too, too much. Anyways, guys, we are now 58 and 45 owning that number one spot in the wild card race. Hopefully we're going to see our new additions that we got from trade deadline coming in very, very soon. Maybe not tomorrow, but next day for sure. So stay tuned for that. Comment down your thoughts below about this entire game, the trade deadline, everything. Hit the like, smash subscribe, and as always, Go Chase Go! Chase, go.